The chcon command is my favorite Linux command. I use the chcon command to change the security context of a file. Here, I have an HTML document that's a part of my website. When I use the curl command to request this document through my web server, the document is served successfully. However, if I create a new HTML document in the temp directory and then move this document into my web server's HTML folder, my web server will show a permission error when requesting this new document. In this case, the permission issue is caused by the new file's security context. I can use the chcon command to directly change the file's security context. Now, the web server can serve my favorite web page successfully. Security context changes that are made using the chcon command may be overwritten later by other commands like the restorecon command which restores default security contexts based on predefined rules. The chcon command is only useful on systems that have SE Linux installed.